Hey everyone, welcome to Apogee Edge 4 Minute Videos for Developers, Season 26, Episode 6. In this episode, we are going to discuss about what are the different aspects you need to consider before estimating the hardware for Apogee Edge Private Cloud. Myself, Anil Sagar, I work at Google and Apogee Platform. Optional prerequisites for this video, you need to understand the Apogee Edge Private Cloud deployment architecture as well as the installation topologies. For that, you can refer earlier 4 Minute Videos. Let's talk about what are the different factors you need to consider before estimating the hardware size for Apache Edge Private Cloud. The first one is installation planet. Whether you are installing Apache in a demo environment or for developer environment or for production environment. Based on that, the number of nodes and the hardware required for each virtual machine is going to be different. So you need to consider what are you doing and which environment you are setting up. And the second one is number of data centers. As you know, Apigee can operate in multiple data centers active active mode. Whether you want one data center, two data centers, three data centers in active active mode is going to influence the number of hardware machines or virtual machines and the kind of amount of capacity RAM and hard disk is required. So you need to decide how many number of data centers that you want. The next one is average TPS and peak TPS. As you know, Apigee can be scaled infinitely and horizontally. So you need to come up with what is average TPS and what is the peak TPS and how many number of hours of activity will be there for the APIs. The next one is proxy complexity. You can build new kind of APIs in Apache Edge API management platform. Would you like to simply expose the API as a pass through for analytics and uh, developer onboarding? Or would you like to add uh, transformation capabilities, traffic management capabilities and security capabilities like OAuth? Or would you like to implement some of your business logic that makes sense for APIs in Apigee Edge API management platform? So you would like to understand how complex your proxy is. Is it low, medium or high? And the next one is message processors resiliency. How many number of message processors can fail without impacting your traffic? As you know, your APIs will be deployed in multiple message processors, which is nothing but the gateways where your API proxy will get executed and how many message processors resiliency that you want. Apigee captures API meta info into Apigee analytics that will give you end-to-end -end visibility. You need to decide how long you would like to retain this analytics data. Based on that, the disk size is going to be different. And the next one is custom analytics data sizes. By default, Apigee does not capture any request response into Apigee Analytics. But as a business, if you would like to capture the data and tie it up with the meta info and get end-to-end -end visibility, you can able to do that. So you need to decide how many number of metrics and dimensions the custom request as a response you would like to capture into Apigee Analytics. And the last one is the high availability factor. Whether you want HA for management server, analytics and developer portal. Based on that, again, number of machines is going to vary. So you need to consider all these factors before you estimate the hardware required for Apigee Edge Private Cloud. Let's say you have answers for all these things. Now, how do I find out how many number of machines that I need? What is the RAM? What is the disk size? What is the number of CPU cores that you are required? We made it easy. If you are evaluating Apigee Edge and would like to know sizing, then only please reach out to us using this particular Google form fill all the information, we can able to get back to you. Again, please fill this information only if you are evaluating Apigee Edge. Then only we can able to come back to you and answer your queries. Also, feel free to use this form if you are already an Apigee customer and would like to know the sizing for Apigee Edge Private Cloud. Thank you for watching this video. If you are interested to evaluate Apigee Edge, you can visit this link and reach out to us. If you have any question, please feel free to post your question in kami.apigee.com. Please share this video with your friends and colleagues and help us spread the love for APIs. You can also subscribe to YouTube channel and get notified if any feature videos.